here with us. We are now on path four of using our VLC in a more effective way. So please subscribe to the channel, like our video, leave us a comment and let us know more about what you think about the channel as well as what we are teaching here. It may interest you to know that in this path four, VLC have something beautiful to give you because we are going to discuss something about how we can use this same VLC to record our entire computer screen. At times you may be in need of telling someone about step by step maybe to install a given software or what to do and you already know how to do them and they are in your system but the other persons want to learn. All it may just take is for you to follow this about giving steps and then after the steps with the help of the VLC, you can actually record the steps, okay? After that, you can forward that video for the person to know how to do that step by steps. Obviously, after this introduction, I'm even going to start recording my screen. So, after this introduction, the next step is actually screen recording. Although I'm not using VLC, there are also other... Uh, beautiful softwares that actually serve the purpose more fully when it comes to screen recording. But VLC is a good one, especially for the beginners. As time progresses, I'm going to introduce you to all others. Please just stay with the channel by you, you are subscribing, liking the video, leaving us comments and sharing the videos. Let's go to the steps. Step number one. Open a VLC on your system. If you don't have VLC on your system, please download this free. That's opening a VLC on your system. It's expected that you go to media. Media is the first one, file menu. Click on media. Come down to open capture device. Open capture device or control C. Here comes this dialog box. Under Capture Device, as you can see, come down to this direct show. Choose Desktop. After choosing Desktop, you will come in here. And um, you could use from 60. Uh, I like using 60 or 70. All right, I use my frame rate as 70. Then I will come to Under play and i choose convert 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 good here comes the destination file in order to choose my destination file before i go to the destination file i have to go to under profile to choose the format to which i want to use that will best suit what i'm doing in my own case i think i will let do with this Okay, this is MP4, choose that. And I will come to browse. I'm browsing in order to locate or to choose the location I want the file to be and the name of the file or the name I would like to give to the file that I'm about to record. Let us assume that I am, let me just give something a bit. Uh, let me choose sample, sample two. Uh, I will choose the location. Let, let me leave it under video. It's allowed. Leave it under video. Then you click on save. Save at the bottom. Here comes the last step in this segment. You need to click on start. What that means is that as soon as you click on start, it will commence the screen recording. So let's go. I click on start. If you look carefully at the bottom, the bottom left of the VLC. You can see that it's counting. It's counting. That means it's recording. You could minimize this and then start your screen recording. Whatever you feel like recording, let us assume that you were in this. You wanted to record this or you have something else you want to record or you want to show person step by step or you have a short video you want to just uh, record or maybe you want to capture a screen in order to teach persons what you or maybe you want to just put a clip on maybe youtube or any other platform and you want to show people sample or steps please use this 
and you will get a very fine result. When you are done capturing, please go back to that your scene. All you need to do is just to stop it and close it and close it. One will say, but we did not save. I had to come that we close. No problem. Just go to the location of the file. Where was those, that file saved initially? Where did you choose? So we choose videos. So go to videos. You choose sample two. You can see sample two here. Let's see what happened. So we can see it is playing all that we have record. So with these few steps, you can actually record your screen and um, DLC is very good in, the, uh, in screen recording. Obviously, they are much better screen recorders the software. But as a beginner, you can actually make wise use of DLC. As we earlier mentioned, DLC is amazing media player. I hope you do enjoy those steps. We have just gave you on the VLC. Let us know more about what you think about VLC on the comment section. Oh, thank you for staying till the end of this tutorial. Definitely you have enjoyed the fact that you can record your screen with those few steps. Let us know what you think on the comment section. Please share, like, leave those comments, beautiful comments of yours. I will be glad to reply you one after the other. Thank you.